into the final day of all of my stories. There was one question that popped up. Uh, how does my day to day look like? Uh, is this relevant to everyone? Do you guys want me to answer this? Okay, I'll answer this first before I go into, into the whole story. So my day to day. I wake up uh, usually around uh, 8 would be pushing it, let's say 9. Now, I used to wake up for, for uh, two months at 5 in the morning. And I would go to bed around 9 or 10. And then, I, I used to love that routine. It's based on a book called The Miracle Morning. I would highly advise it. Now I just wake up at 9, do my own thing, go to bed around 1, sometimes 2. So nothing special on that side. I wake up and do my morning routine, always, no matter what. Daily creed, I read through it, because sometimes I have negative thoughts, I have big projects coming up. I need to read through it and know there's a sentence in there that says um, you're, you're scared but you're going to do it anyway and you're building a life that you love to be in. And uh, I always read through it no matter what. I also have, uh, obviously I go shower, brush my teeth, uh, take some supplements, uh, take my tea usually. And then I start my day, I start my day. Usually if I don't have too much work of studies and stuff like that, I go to my office, I go down, it's in the same building, take all of my stuff, I put it on the desk, and, and then I have, I have my daily creed next to my computer, I have my presence stone. A presence stone, a presence stone is a stone that my mentor made. It's not available in the market, but it's a little stone that looks very nice, it's, it's mined in Mexico. And the idea which you can do with any of your stuff as well, is that you anchor a good feeling to it. So I anchored the feeling of releasing my book to that stone. So every time I look at that stone, which is next to my laptop, and I'm sitting on Facebook, I look back at the stone and I think, ooh, that's not bringing me closer to my goals, and I close Facebook. Uh, and I have uh, also my, in my morning routine, I, I totally missed that, I have my daily creed, but I also have my, uh, I'm missing the name right now, but it's a couple of sentences that you keep repeating for yourself, uh, affirmations. So affirmations, again in this book, The Miracle Morning, you will learn how to do affirmations. In our blog post, we also do that. Uh, we explain how the affirmations work and how it can change your life. If you don't know what affirmations are, it's a sentence that you say for yourself, uh, a belief that you're trying to break. So for instance, you think, let's take my example, which I will share today. So my ISIC journey, in short, if we go to the top of what I did, is I jumped at one point from member to global support team, team leader for the Youth Speak campaign. So in essence, my VP, like your VPs, was uh, ISIC International. I was team leader in ISIC International. And a belief that you can have, for instance, if we take this as an example, is I believe that I can be a member and jump to AI in a matter of months. And you just read this every morning to yourself. You do this in addition to your vision board. So you had your vision board yesterday, right? Everyone has a vision board? So how about you just do affirmations also? Affirmations that you read every day. One day I will film a project with an infinity pool. Or one day I will film a huge ass conference. And, and you read that every day and it just becomes a belief. And then one day, let's say TEDx pops up and they say, do you want to film our conference? And then what will I say? I'll say, hell yeah, I've been prepping for this for months now. And then he walks out this guy that says, well, I'm not sure if I can do it. Because you've been prepping, you've been visualizing. Do you understand that concept? Okay, so everything's done, my morning routine starts, and now I start working. Working is always super focused for me. I don't have Facebook, I don't have YouTube, anything, all of that. In the beginning I used to do this app called Pomodoro. In essence, it's just a timer of 25 minutes. And I used to click on it every time, take a five minute break, then again 25 minutes, just focus on work and get it done. Then when it's done, I start my studies. And 
Then I do evening routine. When it wasn't super hectic, I go to the gym around 7 o'clock, start my evening routine around 8, did some German on Duolingo, uh, and had a Skype talk with a friend or my girlfriend or a sometimes family member. And that's pretty much my day, and I repeat it consistently every day. Don't miss anything. The only thing that varies is the things in between. So my evening routine and my morning routine are always the same. So this is my day today. I just wanted that to be answered. Now